Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I have another back to school haul for you. It is officially September, Labor Day is over, the summer is over, we are barreling towards the fall and I have some fall friendly pieces here to transition into the cooler months. Technically, I'm not back to school. My kids are back to school. They've been in school for a month now because the schools here in Georgia start so early. But I just figured, you know, I need some transition pieces also. So I just wanted to share some of these pieces with you. The first items I will be sharing with you are from Farfetch. I have a brand new Farfetch promo code for you that I will link in the description below. Everything I show here, I'll link in the description. The first is actually not even clothing. It's this because I just had to share it. I finally got a new <laughs> Tom Ford Rose Prick candle. I did a whole video about my favorite luxury candles. First of all, this is my favorite Tom Ford fragrance is the Rose Prick perfume. And then when I saw that they had candles, I immediately got it and I used it up and I needed a new one. So I was able to pick this up at Farfetch because they do offer beauty now, which is amazing. So I was able to save like 15% or 10% off when I got this. I just love this. I couldn't even wait until I filmed this. I already started burning it. <laughs> but you guys, these burn so well. And I also just got a candle warmer because I love the scent of candles so much. I found that if you use a candle warmer, it melts the wax but it doesn't burn the wick. So it makes your candles last so much longer because you're not burning the wick, but the scent, because the wax melts, it permeates the room. So I've already started using that with this. I did burn it, but then I use a candle warmer. <laughs> I love candles, but also the candle warmer definitely helps the longevity of the candle. It smells so good. Even like the box is so fragrant. This like really is more of a winter fragrance, fall, winter. I use it all year round. The perfume itself is you know, it's very heavy rose, like a very musky rose scent. It's not a fresh floral rose, but I, I just love it so much. And I love it as a room fragrance. So if you love the Tom Ford Rose Prick, definitely check out the candle. Next up, I am already wearing. These are the joggers from Sinkasept, I think is the brand name. I tried these on in past videos, but I never pulled the trigger because I wasn't a huge fan of the colors that they offered. But when I saw that they have it in black, I was like, oh, yes, I will always be able to wear this in black. It matches with everything. I don't have any shoes on right now, but I just wanted to show you. Super comfortable. I love these joggers. They have pockets, very form fitting. It has this like weird pleat here that looks like pants. It just is so comfortable. So these joggers I got in a size small and they are just, they fit me perfectly. Now that I own them and I'm wearing them, they're so comfy. I would consider getting this in another color. I like that the bottom part is fitted. You can dress this up with heels, but I probably would mostly wear it with flats. Okay, next up is this jumpsuit from the brand Sweaty Betty. Isn't that such a funny name? I've always seen this brand. It's a athleisure yoga brand. You can use it to work out. The material is very, very stretchy, but it's like smooth. I think it's, it feels like a stretch jersey. It's called the Explorer Jumpsuit, and it just is so nice. You guys, I just live in jumpsuits and rompers. In the summer, I live in rompers, and then in the fall, I warm it up by uh, putting on a, a jumpsuit. So this is a full pants jumpsuit. The bottom is a little bit tapered, not really. So I actually do need to get this uh, tailored a little bit. I have to get it altered because it's a little too long for me. But I love that it has pockets. It has this drawstring here. It looks so cute on. I actually wore a very similar jumpsuit in like a dressier material to one of my holiday company holiday parties a few years ago. And everyone was like, oh my God, like I look so chic. <laughs> this isn't meant to be like a workout jumpsuit, but you can again, dress it up or down. So if I want to dress this up with boots or something, I can. I can wear this with sneakers and it just works out for both purposes. So jumpsuit, here's the back. It's a little open back. You can still wear a bra under this. I love it. I love jumpsuits. And then next up, I think these are going to be my official shoes for the fall. Here are the new Ghani leather Chelsea boots. You guys, I love this style of boots. I just feel so badass wearing these. They can pair with everything. I love the elastic. You don't have to deal with any annoying zippers. I like that the heel comes up and it has a really convenient loop here to put them on. Really cool square toe. I also like that they don't have a seam down the middle. You know how sometimes less expensive boots will have that seam stitched right in the middle so you look like cloven feet? 
cloven hoof is that what it's called so i love these they're very comfortable black soles these i actually sized up so i usually wear a size 36 but with boots i'll go up like a 36 and a half i think they only go by full sizes or something i opted for a size 37 in these also because it is a very high heel you know the higher the boot is the harder it is to pull on especially if it's a smaller shoe size so i got the seven and it actually fits perfectly also because i knew i would be wearing this with thick socks you know in the winter but yeah these are super comfy i love these they pair great with everything Okay, those were all just very practical, versatile, utilitarian pieces. And I did add some decorative pieces to my collection. So next up, my first handbag, the only handbag in this uh, haul is from my favorite, I couldn't resist, another bag from Benedetta Bruzecchi's. I love, love her beaded, stunning, sparkly bags. I just, I just can't help it. <laughs> I can't help it. I love her stuff. She comes up with new colors every season and I just couldn't resist. I can't wait for the video, but it comes wrapped up in this box and it's nicely packaged. It has a bow on it, but I undo it right away. All the bags come with her signature dust bag and this is it. Oh my gosh. I love these blues. I love blue. You guys. It has this really pretty satin on the inside of the strap. The strap itself is beaded. Is it beads crystals whatever same thing with the crystal buckle i don't know how to describe this blue it's like a mermaid oceanic periwinkle blue like but like a darker cloudy periwinkle blue this is the uh leviti mignon style and i already own this style in dune which is like a iridescent beige which is perfect for the summer this will be my winter benedetta bag look at that oh look at the crystals so pretty okay so here it is that's the back, very plain. I love that this is kind of drapey, the beads on here. Even though the color is listed online as navy blue, I just love that the crystals give this really iridescent, like multifaceted effect. So it picks up a lot of different colors. You can see purples and greens in there. Here is the inside, so it flaps open. Even the flap has the beads right there. It's got the satin lining. And even though it has a flap, it also has an interior zipper to keep your stuff safe inside and I love this size bag because it's very small but it still fits my iPhone 12 Pro Max so you can still go out enjoy your dressy date night out but have your phone with you so this new Benedetta bag for the fall in navy blue and one more item because I love blue so much I finally got my dream pair of shoes this actually is my first shoe from this brand. It is the Hangisi pumps in the 90 millimeter heel height in blue satin. And I messed up a little bit because again, this is technically my first pair of Manolos. So I wasn't familiar with the sizing and I vaguely remember trying this on in store and I should have sized down pretty much. So like I said, I'm usually a size 36. I got this in a 36, but it's way too big. I can stick an entire finger between the heel of my foot and the back of the shoe. I, I probably should have gotten a size 35 and a half. I'm going to go ahead and keep the 36 because I can easily make it work. Uh, what I do is I add a heel pad along the back. I usually add a full one in the back because of the sizing. I can add a full one in the back and then more on the, along the side here and then maybe a full insole inside. But this way later on, I will still be able to fit into it <laughs> if my feet swell or for whatever reason. So I would rather have it a little bit bigger and just make it work and then still be able to wear it in the future than have it too small and then I might not be able to wear it if that makes sense. Just in case something happens. So here it is. There is that iconic crystal buckle. I love this color. It's such a rich blue. And then if I want to wear it with this, like it's not an exact match, but it goes, see how it kind of goes together? I love it. So excited to wear this. I remember watching Sex and the City and Sarah Jessica Parker always had her Manolos and I was like, I want to have that one day. Like I will. <laughs> I just got caught up in other brands. So I never ended up purchasing it. And then even like working in corporate world, I just was like, eh, I don't know if I would ever wear this, you know, into the office, but I just will definitely wear this for date night and whatnot. So pretty. Love the crystal. Hung easy. And I got the lower heel because I know that this is something that would be a little more practical for me. So 
my first pair of Manolos. And next up for my kids, for picture day and for just fall photos. I used to do this and just, I feel like the more kids you have, the harder it is to corral them into a photo. I'm trying to get family photos done every year, like a Christmas holiday photo, you know, holiday card. So I got these shirts for my kids from H&M. So from H&M Kids, I got this shirt for all three boys. I have three boys. They are now three, six, and 12. And so even though they're kind of you know, that's that's a pretty big age difference, but I try as much as I can to have them in matching clothes, especially for photos. So I got them this really cute plaid blue flannel shirt from H&M Kids, all in their size. And then the same shirt, but in brown. <laughs> nice neutral color for the fall. It just would look so cute. You know, I usually just have them in similar colored jeans and then a really cute matching shirt. So if I really want to go over the top, I get a complimentary colored top for me and then the same exact shirt for my husband. I'm trying to be that mom. I'm trying to be that organized for the holidays. So really cute shirts from H&M Kids. And then from Bobble Bar, I have some just really cute little stacking jewelry. Here's a thin little bracelet. This is from Bobble Bar. It's just its open-ended cuff. Little ring. Really nice for stacking also. And then I have these earrings from them. So it actually came in a set. This stud is part of a set with this hoop from Bobble Bar. So really cute. And then, did you guys know that they make blankets? So I have this really cozy blanket that is personalized. I got blue because I figured it would go really well with my blue Hermes Avalon blanket and pillow set back there. But it's super cute. They have a bunch of different designs that you can personalize. I have the one with the Cindy written out in like a gradient ombre coloring with the blue all the way going down here and this light blue, very pretty. This would make a great gift for, especially like a housewarming or with back to school, this would be a really cute present if someone's moving into a dorm. And I probably will be getting another one for my mom. She's coming to visit soon from the Philippines, so I'm very excited. So I'm probably gonna get one for her that's personalized. My kids are always battling over the blankets and so if one has my name on it, I can be like, okay, please leave my blanket alone. I guess I should get blankets for them too with their names on it. Yeah, I might do that. So I probably will end up getting personalized blankets for my boys also. And it's so soft, so nice and cozy. Blanket from Bobble Bar. This necklace is also from Bobble Bar. I'm really into layering necklaces and this also has adjustable length. So it's a really nice little solitaire stud necklace. It still feels very much like the summer here in Atlanta but I know it will be cooling off soon and I'm really excited to start wearing these fall pieces as we start transitioning into the fall months. I hope I gave you some great ideas for the fall. Thank you so much for watching and I will catch you in my next video. Bye.